reproduction is one of the most important characteristic of all living organisms it's a biological process by which new individual are produced from their parents reproduction occurs asexually or sexually but in sexual reproduction development of an individual may or may not be internal in some living organisms development of an individual takes place inside the egg outside the body but in some it takes place inside the female body then what are oviparous egg laying animals are animals which reproduce through egg are also known as oviparous in oviparous fertilization and partial development takes place inside the body but they always hatch their egg one outside of their body through the egg almost fishes amphibians reptiles and birds are oviparous in nature but most of mammals and 30% of reptilians just like snakes are viviparous in nature they give birth to egg ones in viviparous both fertilization and development takes place inside the female body this period of development of an individual inside the female body is also known as gestation period it varies from organism to organism all snakes are not oviparous some give birth to egg one most vipers and all of the rattlesnakes anacondas boa constrictors are some examples for the oviparous snakes almost all mammals whether they are terrestrial or aquatic they are viviparous in nature except echidna and platypus echidna and platypus are also known as egg laying mammals have you heard about ovo viviparous they are strange animals Ovo viviparous animals develop in eggs that are inside the mother's organism where the baby comes out directly or they hatch on the outside but immediately after being laid or very soon after example hippocampus